Welcome viewers, you are watching my YouTube channel Bayoga and I am your facilitator Dr. Seema Sharma. Dear viewers, we are going to learn about microscope, its basic parts and their functioning. You know microscope is an optical instrument and it is used for observing microscopic objects, things, living organisms. It helps in magnifying the image of the object. In this, lenses are used to make the smaller object appear larger. First, basic parts of a compound microscope. We are starting with the top part. First is eyepiece. There are two eyepieces in this compound microscope. They have ocular lenses in them for magnifying the image of the object. After eyepiece, there is head. Thereafter, there is an arm which is used as a carrying handle. Beneath eyepiece, there is nose piece and they both are connected with each other with the help of head. This nose piece is also very important children. Pay attention to these uh, tubular structures. They are called as objective lenses. These objective lenses, they are of different magnifying parts and they help in magnifying the image of the object. This is the stage on which stage clips are there which help in uh, fixing the slide on the stage properly. Pay attention to these knobs, coarse adjustment and fine adjustment. They help in focusing by simply rotating these, we can get a clear image. Base, in the base there is a luminator. Now beneath stage, diaphragm and condenser, two things are there for increasing or de decreasing the source of light. So these are the basic parts. So now let's learn little more about what is slide, what is specimen, how they look. So children, specimen, it is the object which we want to view under the microscope. These are permanent laboratory slide in which that object is permanently fixed. This slide which is containing the specimen, it is kept on the stage and by rotating the coarse and fine adjustment knobs, we can view the clear image of the object. It will be somewhat similar to this depending upon the type of object you are observing. And to know more about the practical utility of microscope, let's watch this visual clip. Let's go back to the lab to know little more about practical application of the microscope. It's a compound microscope. Let's know about its basic parts. First top part. Here you can see there are two eyepieces through which we view the microscopic object. These eyepieces have magnifying lenses. Below the eyepiece, it has nose piece. In the nose piece, there are four objective lenses of varying magnifying parts for further enlargement of the image of the object. Next, we have stage. Specimen is kept on the glass slide on the stage. Let's have a look at one prepared slide. This is a glass slide on which we keep the microscopic object in one drop of water or colored solution and observe it by placing it on the stage and adjusting the light. As you can see, source of light is present at the base of the microscope to illuminate the specimen for better observation. While observing the specimen, we view from here through these eyepieces. Initially, the enlarged image of the specimen may appear blur. So focusing is done with the help of these knobs for finer adjustment to observe the specimen with clarity. And believe me, once you get the focus right, you have a breathtaking sight. With this, I'm signing out. It's a bio by from your facilitator, Dr. Seema Sharma. But stay tuned to my bio hub and keep exploring about biology with me.